Hey y'all, it's your friend D, and in today's video, I'm going to be making a haul tree. Haul trees come in all different sizes. You find some that have benches, some have storage underneath, some have storage on top, but I'm going to make one that has a bench and a few cubbies at the bottom of the bench. I've cut out seven pieces of foam board. Each one is cut to three inches by three inches. I'm going to use these pieces to make the cubby holes, and this will also serve as the base for the bench. I have one side done. Now I'm going to take the other three pieces and glue on to this side. So I have the base of the bench made and I'm going to use this leftover foam board to trace out the top of the bench. So I'm just going to sit this on here and just trace around it, make sure I get the right measurements. I'm going to glue this green felt onto the foam board and this will give just a little bit more softness to what will be the cushion of the bench. I have my felt glued on and it's not too pretty on the back, but we're not going to see that part. Now I'm going to take my green fabric and I'm going to glue that into place over the felt. So here's the cushion for the bench and it fits on there pretty good. I'm not going to glue this in place. This way, if I ever want to change the color of the fabric, I can. Now I'm going to work on the back of the haul tree and I cut a piece of foam board to 13 inches tall. To get the width, I just used my bench and I just cut it the same width as the bench. And now I'm going to glue the bench onto this back panel at the bottom here. So I have the bench glued onto the back panel and now I'm going to work on this section. I had these leftover pieces of foam board from another project and they're already cut to a half inch in width. So I'm going to use these to decorate this back portion. So I was playing around with my design and I remembered I need to leave room for the cushion to fit. So I'm going to slide the cushion in place just so I can get an idea of where this foam board needs to sit. So I need to leave that much space. So I'm going to mark that so I don't glue this lower than that. I'm going to cut four one inch pieces from this dowel rod. And I'm going to put a ball of hot glue on one end. And just let it dry into a little ball. After the glue dries, I can paint it. My paint is now dry and these are going to be my coat hooks. So I'm going to poke a hole in the foam and glue these in place. And if you don't have any dowel rods, you can also use push pins. I just didn't have the size that would work for this project. Here's the finished haul tree and I think this was a pretty easy craft to make. This is completely made from leftovers from other projects. All of the foam board, the wooden dowels, and the fabric were all left over from other projects. So my friends, that's all I have for you today. If you have any questions about anything in this video, please leave it in the comments below. I will try my best to answer your questions. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up subscribe, and turn on your notifications. I'll see you next time, my friends. Bye-bye.